for perspective, we were we don't know anything about NASCAR, and so we were learning that like the pit crews are like all ex athletes, Marines, like you're the real deal. Four of us played sports. One of us. Okay, uh, cool. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Phelps had a lot of gold on his Michael neck, Phelps right? Had a lot of gold on his <laughs> oh, neck. come on. You gotta roll your saves, man. Wall? That looks better. There we go. And you have to hop the wall with those? Jump over it with a car coming 55 miles an hour at you. I, guys, I'd run out of gas here. Jump! <laughs> Jump! <laughs> How's. I'm not gonna make it, eh? <laughs> Come on! You gotta get back! I am! It's just taking me time! <laughs> uh, oh. Green or red? Uh, probably red. Red, okay, yeah, thank you. That's a, that's a big red. <laughs> so if you think about that, that's two tenths of a second per lug nut. So if you go ahead and blink your eyes, that's two tenths of a second. Hold on. Huh? A second per lug nut? No, no, they gotta hit all five in under a second. Impossible. No, it's not. You'll, 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 see, you'll see it even when they warm up. Yeah. I, took, I, I know physics. I took physics. That's impossible. And this is going on, not off. Hey, you cost us the race. This is where I feel like we're not like the men of old because they used to run around these things in cowboy boots and a shop jack, which is about 80 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> these things are about 20 pounds, and like I said, instead of 15 strokes, it's just one. Oh, that's still that's not. Lighter. So what you would do? Sorry, this is much lighter. But that is much lighter. <laughs> okay, give it to me. Oh yeah, much lighter. <laughs> the stories we tell everybody was um, every historical story in NASCAR revolves around Dale Earnhardt. Right. So there's a guy who's going to be his backup jackman, and um, he finally gets the opportunity to go in at, at Richmond. And you know he's super excited. He's waited years for this opportunity. So you know race starts. First caution comes out. All the cars come down pit road. He jumps off the wall as Dale slides into his pit, puts 3,500 pounds of race car up on the jack, goes and pulls the right rear tire, and then he has to come back to the jack to drop it to run around to the left side. But when he grabs the jack, he grabs it like this. Oh, thumb in there. Drops 3,500 pounds of race car oh. on his thumb. Oh. Runs around the car, jacks the left side up, and then goes to the back of the pit saw and puts his hand in the cooler. Oh. They, pit, they pit the car six more times that day, and at the end of the race, he climbs up on the pit box and tells the crew chief, hey, I lost my thumb on the first stop of the race. Can I go to the infield? Pit? Are you serious? <laughs> And it just, it speaks to the passion that these guys had to do this. Talladega Nights was filmed at Chip Ganassi Racing. And when we told Will Farrell that story, because he was going to be, they built a special jack for him. When we told him that story, done. He was done. No, he did not want to touch the jack anymore. And like I said, it's funny, we call ourselves the Department of Unrealistic Expectations, because they expect this every single time. Like, these time metrics, they expect every single time. And you're operating on the, like, what, right on the verge of what's humanly possible, right? It sounds like it, yeah. Yeah. And, and that's the same for everyone. Everyone's expectations all the way down are the same. So I've got a whole pit full of these mutants that are like, yeah, that's what I do every day. It's just break, break the laws living. of physics. Right, right. Wow. And, and their jobs are predicated on tenths of seconds. Like we've had to let people go because they were two tenths slower than this other guy. So you're running, like, you're running multiple pro teams. Like this is a pro sports team that you're running here. And then you've got the mechanics who are very good at what they do. And you've got engineering teams here doing and then obviously you need good marketing and sponsorship teams and you need all these super teams to come together for it's not just a car rolling around the track. Absolutely. Yeah. It's Put that crooked. down. No, it's fine. A sawzall? Sick. This is cool. We have a wireless modem. Bro. What are you doing? Shh. Shh. What are you for my first NASCAR experience? Mm -hmm. My mind is being blown at how impressive and elite everything is here. It's professional athletes, it's engineers, it's mechanics, and really fun people. All I can think about is how badly I would crush you if we ever got into this for real. I'd crush you as a jackman, as a tire guy, as a... No one believes everywhere. you. They do. I don't even think you believe yourself.